along to this short demonstration of the Read Easy virtual overlay. If you suffer from visual stress and you use a computer for uh, more than a few hours a day, then you're probably thinking, wouldn't it be nice if I can get the if I could get the benefits of colour while I'm using my computer screen? So you could, of course, put an overlay in front of your computer screen, but that really doesn't work very well. Or you could view your screen through coloured lenses, and that sort of works. But you may as well just change the colour of the background of your screen. Now you can do that by changing the window settings, although they're buried behind lots of menus, they're quite difficult to find. And even then, you can only change the background color if you're using certain programs. So we've created a simple utility called the Read Easy Virtual Overlay, which effectively allows you to change the background color of your screen and uh, even the text should you wish to do so. So you can download the Read Easy Virtual Overlay from this website and when you've done that and installed it, you'll get this little window on the screen like this. And you'll see that there are two tabs here, Windows Color and Virtual Overlay. So I'll just demonstrate Windows Color first. So some programs use the color specified by Windows to form the, the background color. So Notepad, for example, does. So uh, if I want to change the color of the background, all I have to do is to select the color I want. These are the Read Easy colors, 12 colors. Then you click on Color My Windows and hey presto, the background color within Notepad has now changed. Uh, let's just do a couple more. So if you have had a Read Easy assessment at one of our test centers, they'll be able to tell you what color is optimum for you. And then you can download the program, select that color, and you get all the benefits while you're using Notepad or whatever program you're using. You can also change the color of the text to anything you like. That wouldn't be a good combination, but um, sometimes you can find combinations that work uh, really very well. And uh, if you've got several combinations or you've got more than one person using the computer, you can store your favorites just by clicking on uh, that there. That will then store the, your background color and your text color so that next time a single click will set up the same color again. You can also produce a bespoke color. So if you don't like any of the, uh, the Read Easy colors or you feel it could be improved on, then you can click on this color space here and it will change the background to one of those colors. Uh, or you can input the actual RGB value, the red, green and blue value. Or if you click on the, the color picker here and just select more colors, then you can use this color picker to tweak the color to exactly what you want. Maybe something like that. So that is how you can change the windows colors to reset them to black and white. The default colors, you just click on reset my windows colors. That works really well, but unfortunately, uh, not all programs actually use the windows backgrounds color. So you'll find, for example, that most websites don't use the, the windows colors and uh, therefore, if I just change the, uh, the windows colors, then it will have no effect on the color of the website. So if I click on color my window, you can see it has no effect at all. Uh, likewise with PDFs. And in fact, a lot, lot of programs don't use the windows colors. So to get around that, we have produced an alternative way of tinting your screen, which we call the virtual overlay, which is literally like laying an overlay in front of your screen. So if I click on virtual overlay and uh, you can position this virtual overlay any way you like. And if you've got more than one screen, you can position it over both screens or just a portion of the screen. Now you can see at the moment, I've just got it over a portion of the screen. Uh, so if I click on move and size, uh, I can then move the overlay around to cover just a portion of the screen or if you prefer, the whole screen. But let's just cover a portion of the screen like that. I click on save and close 
and you can see that everything underneath that virtual overlay now uh, looks colored. And you can then tweak the color in exactly the same way as I showed you before. You can simply click on this color space or you can enter the RGB values or you can use the color picker like so and you can select exactly what color you want. You can see you can also adjust the transparency and so it gives you really complete control over the virtual overlay and when you want to remove it you just click on remove virtual overlay. So the Read Easy Virtual Overlay program uses two different methods to allow you to change the background of your screen and the text color or to superimpose a virtual overlay over a part or all of the screen. And this allows you to get all the benefits of color without having to use an overlay or colored lenses while you're looking at your computer screen. And this will work on any Windows based programs. It won't work uh, on a Mac or a tablet. It has to be a Windows based program. So I hope you found this demonstration useful and thank you for listening.